Hello everyone, this is financial author Ahmed Dan of AhmedDan.com. On this channel, you'll find financial, travel and more videos just like the one you're watching right now. If you like what you see, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing. Hello everyone, this is Ahmed Dan of AhmedDan.com. Today, I'll have another episode of unboxing video and I'll be unboxing and doing a brief review of the Anchor 3.0 card reader. Uh, this is a card reader that can read eight different types of cards and this is USB 3.0 so this uh, it can transfer at a rate of up to 5 Gbps so it should be very fast and then some of the other features this card re reader has is that you can uh, read and write on two different cards simultaneously and uh, there shouldn't be any uh, software or anything to use it should be right out of the box and you can you should be able to use it on your computer and on anywhere you need to transfer data and uh, the power is uh, powered by the USB port you don't have to use additional battery or anything and there's no drivers required as well so what I'll do, I'll just uh, do the unboxing first and then I have another camera recording right here and I uh, have my laptop right here so once I open up uh, the box then I'll just take out this SD card from this camera and I insert this uh, SD card reader uh, into the USB port on my laptop for the first time and I'll see that uh, how uh, easy or difficult it is to uh, do the transfer so that way you'll have uh, experience uh, which is a fresh our first time using experience and that way it will tell us that whether this is really a user friendly and good card reader or not so let's start with the unboxing here so here's the box uh, this is how it looks like anchor and then on the back of the card there's the model number which is AR200 and USB 3.0 card reader so let's start uh, with the unboxing and I'm expecting this total video to be about 7-8 uh, minutes long so let's open it up here we have the box here so this is how it looks like opening after opening the box and then the card reader is right here okay so I'll just take it out of this slot so this is empty now and then looks like there's a small uh, brochure in here happy that's the first thing it says or not happy so I believe this is that you know uh, if you're happy they're asking you to do a review on Amazon if you're not happy they're asking you to give you a call back not a bad idea I'll put that aside so there's this small welcome guide and it just gives you the specs and everything so these are the some of the things I already mentioned so there are some you know, tips and stuff so I'll just put it aside for now and looks like it has even 18 months warranty which is not a bad thing but this is a very cheap product so uh, you know it doesn't matter how long is the warranty okay so here is the SD card itself so I took it out and it looks like this and uh, here's the card slot so okay let me see if I can see it properly okay I'm not sure how much of the camera is picking up but here are two different slots one is for uh, SD and one is for micro SD so what I'll do I'll keep this here and let's take out this camera now and I'll turn it off okay so I turned off this camera and uh, let's close everything and I'll open up the micro SD card from here I took out the SD card from my camera and what I'll do 
I'll just insert it in here and uh, let's take a look how it goes inside okay so it looks like it's gonna be this way so the anchor name is on the top and it has to be reversed not this way but it would go this way so it put it in and it doesn't go all the way so it just stays outside kind of half of it and uh, the rest of the half goes inside the SD card reader and then I'll put it inside onto my uh, laptop so let's just put this in here and I'll put it in the USB drive here okay so right okay just to show you here okay so here and I'll put this in in here okay so I put it in there and there's a uh, light on here as you can see that uh, there's a green light which should be on okay should be able to see it so just next to anchor that means it's working so what I'll do now I'll try to read those files which this camera recorded uh, of the video I'm doing right now and let's see if it works okay so I'll go in here and let's take a look here uh, it should be the DCIM which is right here and it's it is Canon and it's 10409 uh, so let's press on here and it looks like it is one of these uh, three files so what I'll do I'll just drag and drop it on the desktop to see how fast is it so I'll just do it like this and put it on there and let's see okay so it's uh, transferring at uh, 1.3 uh, actually 39 megabyte per second so it's not bad and the total file looks like actually that information is gone but there are 25 seconds remaining and it looks like fast enough uh, you wouldn't need anything faster than this speed uh, so we'll just wait and see once the transfer is done we'll try to uh, click on the file and try to play it and see if it works properly okay so the transfer is done I'll close this and then I'll just take out remove the uh, SD card reader from here so let's take it out here okay so I removed it and now let's do let's try to play what it is right here okay so it's playing perfectly so there's no problem with the file or anything and fast and then some of the other features this, and then I have understand okay so here's the unboxing video so everything went okay so for the first time I put it on here and then uh, it transferred okay and the speed is very good so this is uh, and it can read two cards at the same time so if you need to uh, you know move even from one to another that should you should be able to do that as well so given the low price of this product this seems to work for everyone and i really i purchased this with my own money this is not a paid review or anything the reason i bought this on my next trip which is coming up in november uh, i if i do not have my laptop with me at some point then i can just you know empty out my uh, camera memory card in the hotel using uh, the hotel computer or the hotel workstation so that time uh, even if I'm out of laptop then I should be able to empty out my all the memory cards and then keep recording on the camera so that's the purpose of this product so that's all for now uh, thank you for watching if you like what you see please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing and I'll see you shortly